Hi, and welcome back to Not Your Average Plumber. We just left the offices of Mike Scott Plumbing over in the Villages, and now we're out here on location. And Jason Scott, one of the owners of Mike Scott Plumbing, is up there, and we're going to go and talk to him and see what he's doing today. Hey, Jason, how's it going today? Hey, how's it going? It's going well. Jason, could you take a moment and tell the folks um, kind of what you're doing over here? We're in a section of the Villages, and uh, part of your job that that uh, you have is to double check your guys doing the rough ends and the contractors and tell the folks a little bit about what you're doing now. Um, well, right now what I'm doing is uh, just double checking our guys' measurements. After they, after you do the pipes and they're pouring the concrete and stuff like that, everything just has to be just precise. Otherwise they miss the wall and your plumbing's not lined up and your toilet and everything else. Yeah, that's correct. Um, if, uh, if our toilet's out or anything's out, we'll have to bring a chip and hammer and chip it up, and that costs us a lot more money and time. So, you know, I just come and make sure that everything where it's supposed to be. Now, we were riding over here with Nate Owens earlier, and he was telling us this section over here is, is almost built out, and none of this stuff was here uh, 60 days ago. Is that true? Yeah, that's correct. Um, this is probably the fastest uh, project that I've ever seen. Um, we do 10 of these a day. Um, so we're... So you're on the go. You're going and going and not only checking the jobs, you're keeping the contractors happy, you and Nate working side by side and, and, and keeping this chaotic, organized chaos going all the time. Oh uh, yeah, this is probably the, the fastest paced uh, project I've ever seen. Um, you, you'll never find another project like this. That uh, It's like a machine. I mean, it, it just goes and goes and goes. And if uh, not everybody is doing their part, you know, it seems to choke up a little bit. but. A uh, typical day, like for me, I'll start off um, coming out here. I'll go over all the jobs from the day before to make sure that they're ready for the inspector to come. And like basically, we'll make sure that the, the pipe's topped off, that there's water all the way to the, to the top of the pipe. You have to have a five foot head. Um, we'll check the gauge, make sure that there's 100 pounds on the gauge. And uh, we'll go over all the PVC pipe and make sure there's enough fall on the pipe and everything's safe in really well. So if other contractors come in, they're not pushing our pipes around. And, and basically, that's it. I just kind of tighten everything up a little bit. And, and then after that, once all the inspections have been done, then I'll start um, coming behind the guys and make sure that that their uh, jobs are done correctly. That there's you know there's no mistakes and. And if anyone calls me in between there, I'll run over and take care of whatever they need, any of the supervisors or any of the other um, contractors. So Mike Scott Plumbing's actually been involved in this project personally for about the last 12 years? Yeah, that's correct. And I've been out here for about five years. But it seems like about 12 years since this place is just nonstop. Well, I, I appreciate you taking the time with us today, Jason. I'm one of the hardest working owners that we have out here. So, Thank you, uh, Kev. I know you got a lot more to do, and uh, we're going to go and see some of the villages and some of the projects we've got going. All right. Well, you guys have a nice day. Thanks again, Jay.